Hey mga kanayan, this is Aurelio Isip and welcome to Isip Nayan. So for today's topic, we will talk about the perfect square trinomial. How to factor the perfect square trinomial. So what is the perfect square trinomial? So tara. So what is the perfect square trinomial? No. So perfect square trinomial can be illustrated as the x squared plus 2xy plus y squared equals the quantity of x plus y squared. Or, can be illustrated as x squared minus 2xy plus y squared equals the quantity of x minus y squared. No? So, yan yung parang formula natin. Perfect squares. No? Pag sinabi natin perfect square, sa mga number, no? sa, sa number, yan na yung 1, 4, 9, 27, 16, 25. <clears throat> Sila yung mga perfect square, squares na number. No? So, paano natin malalaman kung ang itong per, ang trinomial na ito is a perfect square trinomial? First, no, we have to satisfy this condition. No? Kailangan ma-meet natin yung, yung kanit, gandang condition. No? Two conditions we have. No? So, first is if the first term is a perfect square and the last term is a perfect square. No? So, kung perfect square sila, so, nasatisfy niya sa ang condition natin. Alawa, no? The middle term of this trinomial, no? the middle term, yung pinakagit na, kapag yung product niya, no? product ng first, ng square root, ng first term, kaya ng second term, then, twice the product niya, at ang sagot is the middle term, yan ay masasabi natin na ang this trinomial is a perfect square trinomial. So, ano natin ipapactor to? So, let's have an example. So, for example, no, this trinomial, r squared plus 16r plus 64. Perfect square trinomial ba to? So, pwede natin isulat to na r squared plus 16r plus 8 squared because 8 squared is 64. So, ang tanong, perfect square trinomial kaya to? No? So, Sabi daw, no? Kung first condition natin, kung square to, perfect square to, perfect square to, yes, no? Sang condition natin yan. And then, kapag in-square root daw natin yung first term, which is the r, and square root natin yung 64, 8 squared, no? O, and ay 8. At pag multiply natin yan, no? This is 8r multiplied by 2, no? Yan ay 16r. So, ibig sabihin, dahil 16r to, so, this is a perfect square trinomial. So, yan, perfect square trinomial siya. So, so paano siya, paano siya i-factor? So, step number one, no? Uh, kailangan i-square natin yung first term. Alam na natin square root ng first term, which is r. And square root natin yung second term. Alam natin yung square root second term. Square root ng 8 squared is 8. So, r, 8. So, ang mangyari dyan, no? Parang yung ating formula lang, no? Na na x, ang x natin dito ngayon, no? Ito yung, yung ating r, ito yung ating x. Ngayon, yung y natin, ito yung ating 8. So, meaning, no? Kung ito yung ating parang formula, no? So, mangyayari dyan, ang r, which is your our x, and yung y natin, which is 8, no? gagayahin lang natin kung ano yung sign na nandito. So, plus 8 at lalagay natin ng squared. So, ganun mag-factor nito. No, pwede rin natin isulit to as r plus 8 then r plus 8 or r plus 8 quantity of tapos is squared. So, for example, number 2, no? P squared minus 6p plus 9. Pwede natin to isulat as p squared minus 6p plus 3 squared, no? So, perfect square to, perfect square to, no? Kapag ano yun, this is a perfect square trinomial. So, paano natin siya kinafactor? So, para lang yung katulad natin, second format natin, no? Na x squared minus 2xy plus y squared equals the quantity of x <coughs> minus y squared. So, ang mangyari dito, ang x natin dito is p, ang y natin dito is 3. No? So, ang gagawin lang natin, no? So, gagawin natin, ay mapaktor natin yan as x, ah, sorry, this is p, no? p, then p, gagayahin lang natin 3, 
3. Tapos kung ito ay negative, negative siya or minus siya. O di kaya, pwede rin namang, no? Yan ay P minus 3 squared. Example number 3, no? So, 75A cubed plus 30A squared plus 3A. So, ano napapansin nyo rito, no? Wala tayong constant, no? Yung number lang na wala kasamang letter. Lahat to ay may letter. So, may, ibig sabihin, may gagawin ka rito, no? So, meron tayong tinatawag na common monomial factor, no? Kung mga hindi nyo pa napapansin yung first uh, video ko about this factoring, no? Ang tinakil ko is the common monomial factor. So, hanapin natin common monomial factor. So, in this example, no? Ang common, common monomial factor natin is 3A. Ano ba yung meron sa kanilang term? Sa tatlong term na to, no? Ano yung meron sa kanila? Meron sa kanilang A. So, isa yung factor na yan is A. Tapos, divisible lahat yun sa 3. Yung 75, 30, tsaka 3. So, ibig sabihin, i-divide natin siya ng 3A. So, 3A this is the 75A cubed, then plus 30A squared over 3A plus 3A over 3A. So, i-divide natin siya ng 3A kasi yan yung common monomer factor. So, pag divide na natin yan, no? So, ito ay magiging 25, 25A squared plus 10a plus 1. So, ito, no, ay is another factor ng, ng itong ating example, no. Ang factor niya is 3a plus 25a squared multiply by 25a squared plus 10a plus 1. Ngayon, this is an example of perfect square trinomial. So, ipapaktor pa natin to. Perfect square trinomial to kasi, no, perfect square yung first term tsaka yung last term. So, titingnan natin, no? So, paano tayo nag factor? No? So, first, square root natin. So, square root ng 25a. So, square root of 25a squared is 5a. No? First term yan. Yung 1, no? Square root ng 1 is just a1. So, ang gagawin natin, no? So, ilalagay natin siya no? as uh, yung x natin is 5a this is our x and this is our y so ang x natin is 5a then ito ay 1 no? tapos kukopyahin natin kung ano yung sign dito, so ito ay plus lalagyan natin dito ng squared so yan, so meaning ang factor ng 75a cubed plus 30a squared plus 3a is 5a plus 1 na quantity no? squared times, yan ng 3a. Ito ba example number 4? So, k squared plus 5k plus 6. This time, kung mapapansin nyo, no, hindi siya perfect square trinomial. Bakit? Kasi, hindi naman to perfect square. Doon pa lang, eh, no? hindi na nasatisfy yung condition natin. No? So, hindi siya perfect square trinomial. Pero, kailangan natin to i-factor no nang hindi dito perfect square trinomial so ano gagawin natin no so ang pagpapaktor nito no so magkakaroon tayo ng trial and error dito so alamin natin what is what are the factor of 6 kapag nagmultiply tayo ng dalawang number na 6 ang lalabas no it's either 6 times 1 no equal siya sa 6 ano pa ah uh, 3 times 2 equal siya sa 6. Ano pa? No? Negative 6 tsaka negative 1. Time, uh, pag minultiply natin to positive 6 din yung sagot. Ano pa? Uh, negative 3 times negative 2. Positive 6 din yan. So, ang gagawin natin, no? Aalamin natin na kapag pinag-plus natin yung dalawang factor nila, ang lalabas is yung nasa middle term. So, alin dito? So, kapag ito ay 6 plus 1, Ito ay 7. Ito ay 3 plus 2. Ito ay 5. Ito naman, negative 6 plus negative 1 equals negative 7. Ito naman ay negative 3 plus negative 2. Ito ay negative 5. So, alin dyan? No? Alin dyan? Sa mga bakla na pag pinag-plus, ay ito ang lalabas. So, ang makikita natin dito, ito ay yung 
pangalawa, no? So ibig sabihin, no, ang gagawin natin diyan, no? So siya ang factor natin diyan is k tapos k, no? Alin yung dalawang factor 3 tsaka 2. So 3 tsaka 2, pwede nating baliktarin rin yan, ha? Pwede mauna yung 2, pwede mauna yung 3. Tapos, kung ano yung sign, no? Ayun yung gagayain natin. So, plus 3, tsaka plus 2. So, yan yung factor ng not perfect square trinomial. So, that's all, no? Sana may natutunan kayo. So, mag-iiwan ako sa inyo ng tanong, no? So, pakilagay yung sagot sa comment section sa baba, no? And then, uh, thank you, no? Uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. No, so that's all. Good luck, soldier.